Residents aboard Marine Corps Air Station Iwakuni spend time training to improve their strength, power, and conditioning at the Ironworks Gym. The High Intensity Tactical Training Program, or HIT, features several workouts focused on improving one purpose, combat conditioning. This program is a comprehensive strength conditioning program developed for the tactical athlete specifically. Mondays are very specific to combat. We do a lot of functional type training. We actually encourage the Marines and our sailors, soldiers, airmen that show up to show up in boots and utes. So it's very specific to the combat fitness testing and field exercises. The HIT classes give participants the opportunity to work with fitness instructors and service members from across the air station. Well, I think the biggest difference is, is there's actually like a set program and then also you have a lot more people here so the the support and then the extra push from the instructors and, and the extra push from your peers it, it's always it's always better you're, you're always improving the hit program sometimes uses some training techniques not usually found in a traditional gym here instead of flat benches and dumbbells athletes find suspension straps kettlebells and bungee cords this helps the athlete learn how to decelerate and accelerate in multiple planes of motion, right? So cutting, turning, stopping, starting. Uh, the resistance is just another element to make it a little bit more difficult and help progress their training. Do it right. Do it right. All right, guys, grab some kettlebells. Just because it start, I started you with the deadlift doesn't mean you start with the, you have to start with the deadlift. Basically, we want our service members to be mission ready and resilient no matter what. Also, while decreasing their chance of injury in and out of the field. High intensity tactical training classes take place Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays from 11.30 a.m. to 12.30 p.m. Corporal Brock Gall, Marine Corps Air Station Iwakuni, Japan.